retro device plugged in HDMI output right we have a HDMI cable running out to the um, external monitor it could be a TV as well and then we have the charger plugged in and a USB controller plugged in so what we're gonna do we're gonna boot this machine all right so machine booted all right look at this guy so that's our secondary screen available and we have our retro device active here all right so look at this look at this all right so we, we're gonna see our official boot screen here let's go guys let's go right so look at this your secondary screen you you done with this here you could actually close this down right there and now you have projecting here in your tv the console mode right so what we're doing guys we are basically distributing consoles right computers to act as a console for our retro devices right it's super easy to do all you have to do is just plug in your retro device we get a hdmi cable with the purchase and you get a usb controller so you plug it in and you just hit the power button we already program and set everything for external display so this hdmi cable runs to your tv or your monitor that supports hdmi and song it goes directly so this unit here now will act as a console like you buy a playstation 3 um you know like a console now so what we're doing we're providing these units as console units for our retro devices so you see the retro is plugged in and we have here uh hdmi ready monitor all right so it could work with tv it could work with anything that's supporting hdmi the beautiful thing about these laptops that we are distributing because we have some towers too it's not limited to hdmi if you have a vga a monitor home that has vga you could literally use a vga but what we're trying to do is get the quality out of these devices that's why we recommend using the hdmi so that's what we're doing now guys mass distribution with these laptops that we program to act as consoles for our retro devices so this particular item you're all watching here we have this one here for 2000 tt you get a usb control you get your retro device with your basic selection and that's with five virtual consoles in total that's 2000 plus games you're receiving that's fb neo nintendo super nintendo game boy advance sega genesis right in total that's 2610 there so that's 2000 plus games you're looking at so this is what we're doing guys right now i'm trying to do videos on each product we are doing an introductory price to these consoles distribution that i program these computers to read and work with our usb re retro devices so i just want to give you a quick example how it's performing so i'm going to just launch a quick game just to show you how it's working all right so let me just launch a fb new game all right so we're gonna launch a game here let's look at uh, metal slug all right so this is you getting full value for your money guys you get in quality and we are doing these systems and distributing all you have to do is just plug and play right these units can support two to three controllers and we have that in stock too so that's what we're doing we basically providing the units to run our retro device so this setup here is two thousand dollars right so just gonna just put in some coins here all right look at the play here guys and this could work with any hdmi device any tv that supports hdmi all right so you have a full console to run our retro all right so this is a steal of a deal introductory price right you get this item here which could operate um, as a console for our machines you just plug in as i told you hdmi cable that comes with a tv to the machine you have your retro device plug in via usb to the machine you have a usb control plug in to the machine and also um the charging cable to the machine so once you plug in that you power up guys it's straight into the play mode right 
brings you into the screen here you select and you play so let me know what you guys think so i have this package here with this particular item for 2000 tt we are doing deliveries nationwide we can meet up at south park and that will be a free delivery to south park or even clarkson bay flyover let me know what you guys think